guy here and this is small open shed by pleasant view farms on farming simulator 22 it's for all platforms pc mac and console i'm on ps5 here on rock crawl for this test of this little cow barn or a cow pen 1.51 megabytes to download eight slots on console you'll find it under animals and cows and there it is uh you can change the color left or right on your d-pad to whatever color you like uh, this is a neat little barn um, here is the animal trigger 30 cows let's get our help window on uh, come on there we go um, right so these gates oh this gate yes there we go open the gate so open the gates because this is where the food goes in here also bales uh grass and hay bales if you prefer the straw goes in here straw bales apparently hello miss mrs cow mrs mr and mrs cow mrs cow um according to the description uh the manure will spawn in here somewhere uh, see, we have a capacity for manure, so no need, no need to put down a manure silo. Food is 30,000, straw 10,000 liters. And uh, we can look at this particular animal and know how old it is. And so forth and so on. Right, so um, quite simple, nice little barn. Uh, 30 cows is actually quite a lot for this size of a barn compared to the base game. Uh, some of the base game ones. Um, so what are we going to do now? Well, we're going to uh, run it forward. Uh, let's take a look at it here in our... There we go. So straw and we got everything filled. No slurry or milk produced. So... Um, so don't expect that. So just manure. And... Um, right. Farm Dog Max is... Uh, mm, mm, he, he likes milk. He wants milk. Uh, so, let's go sleep and see what happens. All right, we are back. And take a look at that. That is a pile of manure for sure. So, that's kind of neat. Um, what else? Uh, food. Food and straw capacities are still well, well above half. So that's good. Here is um, the straw going in. Straw bales go in inside the barn. There we go. So inside here is the straw trigger. It will accept bales. <laughs> the cow's walking on top of the manure. Um, we'll show you the food going in here. And um, we're just going to turn around. And uh, I guess we could drive through. Let's drive in circles a little bit. <laughs> um, right, so we're going to drive over top of this to get to the food trigger. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> uh, obviously, uh, this is probably too... Oh, wait. You didn't even have to go inside there. Oh, nice. Okay. So you can fill it from outside, which is really nice. There we go. Food going in. Um, let's uh, let's grab. Uh, oh, it's over there. Let's grab the small one to see if we can load manure automatically, or we got to scoop it out. That is what I'm curious about and see uh, if we if you have to scoop it out it's actually get, like not hard to get to uh do we have an automatic no so just to uh just to demonstrate here we have a bucket Uh, this is like an over oversized bucket but it will still will gen demonstrate there we go and we have cleaned up 5900 liters of manure and uh 
Yeah, so actually it's uh, fairly interactive. It's uh, You have to scoop it out yourself, which is... Um, there we go. Dump it into the trailer. Nice. So, uh, nice. I kind of like it. I like that it takes bales. I like the manure spawning here. That seems realistic and that you have to scoop it out. I kind of like that too. Um, it would... The no milk or slurry, I understand why that is. Perhaps, perhaps maybe, um, put another one that does produce milk and slurry, a little different design. But anyways, that's just my opinion. And there you have it. Small open shed by Pleasant View Farms on Farming Simulator 22. Thank you for watching. And remember, it's only a game. So till next time, bye for now.